Hey guys, I'm back with episode 42 of Hey Guy, It's Minecraft. Well, in the last episode I started going through some of the new changes to the game in beta 1.2. I think I'll do the same thing for this episode, which means the stuff I had previously planned for episode 41 is going to be pushed back even further. Um, you can see here we've got some black sheep, yo and they drop this black black wool 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 and then I've got some more flowers here um, so I'm gonna show you guys how to make some dye if you aren't reading the forums already okay flowers well you don't even have to use this you could do them straight from your inventory make yellow dye looks like two a piece and then you know there's black wool here bones also make something called bone meal there are rumors that it insta grows crops and stuff I'm not sure I really believe that but um, you know it's worth a try I don't even know how <laughs> how you'd use it um, and then it is confirmed that spiders do crawl up walls which worries me because I don't have any walls to keep them out of here so I'm gonna have to do something about that and I really don't feel like making glass walls everywhere that just seems like overkill, you know what I mean? Um, some other corrections, I guess the lapis lazuli is not used for crafting tools, in fact it's used only for making dye at this point. So there's that. Sandstone I'll make some stand stone for you guys here in a second after I'm done trying this piecemeal stuff out. Oh, whoa. Not like I really need that. I wonder if it works on trees too. Because holy crap, if it works on trees, that makes skeletons like the ultimate mob in this game and I definitely need to make a grinder inside of a skeleton dungeon as soon as I find one. So once I check to see if it works on trees, um, that's about all I have left to show you guys for now. Yeah, one other thing that I wanted to show you guys as far as die goes. Let's go back down here. As long as there are no spiders. Oh, let's try the trees first. Oh, I don't have any more. I think I stored it down here. Oh, while well, I'm down here check this out this is I carved out that room remember I told you about that um, and I'm making a storage room this is what I'm going to call my heavy storage room which is going to carry full stacks of everything and I made my first sign ever and it's gonna take full stacks of stone and, and stuff like that just because well why not know what I mean I may as well put this shit in here. There's no reason not to. So, let me pull this sign out. Use it right there. It should go here. Dirt. How many... Did I do it like that? Yes. So there's dirt there. 
so this whole room is just gonna have rows upon rows of storage chests when I get around to it. If I don't end up abandoning this base. It's a good thing I left these doors here. <laughs> um, oh yeah, I think I have them in here. Bone meal. So let's go try these trees out. If this works, I will be incredibly happy. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Uh, well, I guess it uses them every time you hit, even though uh, it doesn't always work. Wow. <laughs> Skeletons aren't so bad anymore. Interesting. Let's see. What else was there? Oh, yeah. There, in addition to the yellow and red dyes, there is also a green dye, which can be made by putting your cactus in the furnace. It's a one to one thing. You know, one coal, one or eight cactus makes eight green cactus green dye. Alright, and then another thing is you can craft coal, no wait wait, charcoal, charcoal, out of wood. No. Let's see here. So, actually it's not in there. You could actually do it with coal also, but that's kind of boring. So I'm going to use wood planks for it and it makes charcoal. Blue 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 blue. Unfortunately because it's called charcoal and not coal they don't stack as you can see here. So essentially actually let's see if it makes torches still. Yes, okay. And it looks like they stack with the normal torches. So that's cool. That's very cool. Um, what else? Okay. Sandstone. Haven't actually made one of these yet. Here's a sandstone. Let's go compare it to sand 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 oh, pig put the sandstone next to a sand and check out the difference interesting um from what i've heard okay you break it and it gives you the sandstone back it acts exactly the same as normal cobblestone so that's good because that's a new material that we can build out of and it's a lot easier to get unfortunately you need four four pieces of sand four blocks of sand in order to make one sandstone so that's the only I guess that's the only disadvantage Oh, excuse me. Uh, no, 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 no. I can't think of anything else that I wanted to show you guys at this point. Um, apparently there's something you can craft called a dispenser, which can be used to fire arrows. Hey, let's try combining some of these. Um, yeah, you can... You can use it to dispense things or fire arrows, apparently. Oh, okay. What happens? Okay, so you can't do three, it seems like. How about red and green? Nope. Green and yellow? Nope. Green and orange? Nope. So, that's how.
how you combine dies, <laughs> I guess. You just can they go anywhere? Yeah. So as long as there are two of them, two different colors in there. That's cool. Oh, may as well try dyeing some wool while I'm in this episode too. That makes sense, right? No, that's not wool, that's snow. Let's see here. Okay. So it can be anywhere. Once again. See what the red looks like. And the yellow. And the orange. Ooh, that's bright. Go ahead and <laughs> using my testing area, which I will now declare is right there. I will I shall now place the wool onto the testing area. One, two, three, and four. That's pretty nifty. I don't particularly like the look, but maybe with the texture pack, if somebody finally updates them, that'll work. Um, I think one of the cool potential uses for these new dye uh, colored blocks and stuff is people can make new quote unquote materials just by editing the textures. And I like that idea because then, you know, it's not like adding a new block to the game like a mod, but more just like, you know, texture wise, here's a mod in case you don't actually like the colored wool. Um, hopefully at some point we'll have a better use for wool. Wool, it's such a hard word to say because it seems pretty useless at this point. <laughs> Excuse me again. But, uh, yeah, it, I mean, it's not really a viable building tool because it catches on fire. And I guess you can use it for decorations. I mean, but it just doesn't look as good as some of the other materials, so... Whatever. I'm out of time. So this was episode 42. I will see you guys for episode 43. Until then, keep playing Minecraft. And leave me some feedback. If you've got friends, uh, let your friends know that I'm doing videos. And have them subscribe and stuff. And hey, click that thumbs up button. I don't think I've asked you guys to do that very much. But do it click on the thumbs up button get my videos some likes alright <laughs> take care and I'll see you guys for episode 43